What a load of crap. Those first years making up rumours about ghosts in the halls. There's no ghosts, I'm sure of it. Uh, it was the second years, actually, and we haven't even searched the corridor yet. Carrie, you don't really think there's a ghost roaming around the halls. And even if there was one, they wouldn't be stupid enough to go practicing magic spells in that storage closet or whatever it is they do. <laughs> Can we not just go for a walk? Like, this place creeps me out. Are you seriously scared? Just go home already. You're spoiling all the fun. I'm just trying to protect us all. <laughs> she actually believes the ghost. <laughs> Come here, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to scare you like that, okay? It's fine. Don't worry about it. We can just go to the cafe now. Look, that sounds great. I'm just going to go up here and get my woodwork piece, okay? Why would your woodwork piece be in here anyways? Um, it was, it, it, it was too big to fit in the woodwork room. <sighs> Cara, could you just get it there? It's on the top shelf. I don't know why you'd ask me. I'm the shortest, but I guess. Go, 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 go. Let me out! I swear to God, if you don't let me out! They're not coming back. Aren't you even going to ask my name? Don't come near me or I'll throw it. I don't think you'd do much damage there, if I'm being honest. My name's Nicole. Thanks for asking. And why is it that you're in such a rush to get away from me? But you roam the halls and seek revenge on those who deceive you. That's what everyone says. I'm not a villain from Scooby-Doo, you know. I'm stuck in here, so the only person I can kill is you. <laughs> only joking. It's nice to have some company for once, I suppose. How did you end up here? I was also locked in here by my friends. For some warped reason, they thought it was funny to have me screaming in here. I was afraid of the dark, you see, and it wasn't so funny when a fire broke out and I was left in here on my own. I'm sorry. I'm sure they didn't mean for you to get hurt. Yeah, well, I'll never know. The school was rebuilt. It was like nothing ever happened. And, and I'm still trapped here in the dark. I'm sure my friends were only messing and they didn't really mean to hurt me. It's my own fault anyways. If I wasn't so scared, they wouldn't have done it in the first place. Kara, who cares if you're scared or not? That's no reason to lock someone in some storage closet. If they really were your friends, you'd be at that nice cafe that you were talking about earlier, eating sandwiches. But since that's not the case, I suggest you move on and realize that they are not your friends. <sighs> no, I suppose they're not. Look, you won't be here for much longer. Say you do get out. How about I help you get some revenge on these so-called friends of yours? Here, come on, let's go check on her. Yeah, it's a great plan. I just hope it teaches them not to go around and scare me again. Oh, don't worry. I'll make sure they never do anything like that again. You won't hurt them, will you? I know what they did was wrong, but people can learn from their mistakes. Some people just can't move on, Kara. Kara! Kara! Oh, it's open. I could have swore I locked this. Kara? Kara, come out wherever you are. Stop playing hide and seek with the ghost. Oh, for God's sake, Kara, come on. Where'd she go? Here she is. What are you 
you doing? You can't do something like this. Where did you even get it? A janitor dropped them in the closet a while ago. See, I had all this time. What did you expect me to do? Did you see what my friends did to me? But I never got the chance to confront them or ask them what, why they did what they did. So I got angry. And right now, I'm angry at you for what you did. And if this is the closest I can get to revenge for what happened to me, then I'll take it. Nicole, stop. You don't have to do this. You're mad and you have every right to be, but killing all these people isn't going to make it better. You'll just be left with more anger and shame because if you do this, you're just as bad as the person as your friends were to you. I need to be left with something. I can't be alone in the school anymore. I'm sorry, Kara. Right there, literally That's what he would say to us in this moment. He'd laugh at us. I know.